revenge is complete. My hated enemies thought they had destroyed me. But I am not so easily destroyed. I was merely biding my time, awaiting the right moment for my ninja forces to strike. <laughs> Struck hard. They herded my enemies to me like sheep to the slaughter. And even though allies foolishly came to their aid, my enemies were forced to make a cowardly retreat. But vengeance was mine nonetheless. At last, the turtles are no more! I have risen from the ashes! Trapped like rats! No offense, Sensei. Leo's in really bad shape. We have to get him out of here. Working on it! What are you doing? I remember when we first moved in, there was a hole in the wall where a cooling unit was removed. There. That's it! Everybody book! Forgive me, Miss O'Neill, but we must leave the past behind for now. If we are to have a future, Leonardo is badly injured and needs a safe place to heal. What about the lair? Shredder has a whole ninja army down in the sewers, remember? And we're in no shape to fight. Hey, we don't run from nobody. And yet we must. But where? Fellas, I know just the place. You're gonna love my grandma's old farmhouse. Me and my cousin Sid used to play there all the time when we was kids. April? How do you think Leo's holding up? Oh, man! It sucks being cold-blooded. Is he gonna make it, Sensei? Only time will tell. This is it! Just like I remember. Ah, isn't it great? Great does not even begin to describe this place. All right, so it needs some fixing up. The place got a little run down since Grandma passed away. <laughs> When was that? In the late Jurassic? Dude, you live in a sewer? Uh, Leo? The foot's back in business. Profits are up and the turtles are history. Why are we not celebrating, Master? Where are the bodies? We burned that building to the ground. I think we can safely assume that- We can assume nothing. My enemies assumed they had destroyed me, and it cost them dearly. I can ill afford to make the same mistake. I require evidence of their demise. Scientific proof, perhaps? Oh, I did not send for you, Stockman. And that was your first mistake. <sighs> your arrogance is exceeded only by your inability to learn from your... Punishments. What do you want? A simple exchange of goods and services. I can provide you the most sophisticated DNA analysis of Ms. O'Neill's destroyed shop. You'll know beyond the shadow of a doubt if the turtle survived or not. And in exchange? Full 
access to this fascinating artifact you fished from the East River. A brief glimpse of its technological secrets allowed me to create the Foot Tech Ninjas. Imagine what I might do were I given complete access to it. A win-win proposition, I'd say. Provide me with proof that the accursed turtles are no more, and you shall be so rewarded. Fail me, and your next punishment will be your final punishment. recovering from more than just physical wounds. His spirit has also been grievously injured. You think he can hear us? Perhaps. Hey, Leo. It's me, Don. Listen, you're gonna pull through this. I know you are. You have to. I mean, you know what kind of trouble we'd get in without you. Like, remember the time I built that remote control car? Check out the turning radius on this thing, Leo! Oh, Remind me never to let you behind the wheel of a real car. Hang on. I'll get it. There was all kinds of debris clogging up the tunnel, and the sewers were overflowing from the heavy rains we just had. But I wasn't paying attention to that. I just wanted my car back. for me that day, Leo. You always do. And I know you will again. <laughs> Looks like you got him hanging on your every word, Don. Um. Hey! I think he heard you, Raffi! Maybe talking to him does help. It is said that the voice of a loved one can guide a lost spirit back to its home. Mind if I take a crack at it? Listen, bro. Just, like, concentrate on my voice. Come on, Leo. You know how focused you get when you set your mind on something? Like, remember that time you were trying to perfect your katas? Yeah! Yeah! Hey, Leo! You seen my game guy anywhere? Hello? Anyone home? Nothing in the world was going to break your concentration. But that wasn't going to stop me from trying. <laughs> you know how I hate to be ignored. decided if I couldn't make you laugh, maybe I should just make you say, ow. Oh. Was I disturbing you? Leo, when you put your mind to something, you're unstoppable. So, 
how about using that famous focus of yours to come back to us? Ha! Huh. You ask me, Leo's not coming back because he's afraid. No one asked you. You know, he got his butt whooped, and now he's too chicken to come back and face it. That's enough, Raph. Well, I say, who needs you? It's not like we can't get on without you playing fearless leader. Back in the day, I always figured I was gonna be Top Turtle. I was strongest, bravest. Remember the time I brought you to that closed-off section of the sewer? We were playing follow the leader. Raph, you can't go in there. Hey, it's my turn. You're supposed to follow my lead. But Splinter says... Splinter says, Splinter says, when are you gonna think for yourself? That's what a real leader does. Now catch me if you can! Dead end. Must have taken a wrong turn. Uh, Leo? Come on, let's jet. No way. This walking handbag's intruding on our turf. You're the intruder, Shelfer Brains. Now let's get out of here. Hey, I'm the leader this turn, remember? Fine, handle it your way. Can I offer a strategy tip? No! I got him on the ropes! He's right where I want him! Right, that's it! What'd you do? What'd you do? <laughs> pressure points. Alligator pressure points? Little trick Master Splinter taught me. Come on, he won't sleep forever. How about another round of follow the leader? As in, back home. Lead the way. Uh, I don't even know why I told you that story. I, I guess you just... I mean, what I'm trying to say is... Your brother hears you, Raphael. He understands. Nothing. I've run every search pattern, every type of analysis, but there's no conclusive evidence that anyone human or a turtle perished in this blaze. But I... I can't go back to Shredder with nothing. I... Huh? Hmm... <laughs> if I can't find any evidence, then I'll just have to make some evidence. Leonardo, my son. You must gather all your strength and confront your fear, just as you did many years ago. Come on, Sensei. Leo's never been afraid of nothing in his life. Not true, my son. Do you recall, Leonardo, our early days? We were scavenging for food and supplies. Come, my son. There are more useful items to be found on the upper levels. Stretch for miles in all directions. To avoid losing your way, you must observe your surroundings carefully. Come along, Leonardo. We are nearly at the top. I can't. Leonardo, you must. <laughs> You had an irrational and paralyzing fear of heights. In the weeks that followed, I worked closely to help you overcome your fear. Focusing on the way of balance. Gradually building your confidence. 
now, my son, remove your blindfold. I was beginning to wonder if you would ever conquer the dark imaginings of your mind. But I was unwilling to give up. We must continue on, Leonardo. Y you go ahead, Master Splinter. I'll go around the long way. That could take hours, my son. That's okay. I could use the exercise. saved yourself at any time. And you would still be consumed by your fear. By focusing on the task at hand, you were able to clear your mind of all distractions. Do so again. Ignore the fear, my son. Let your spirit heal. Find your way home. Return to us. Is he... No... fear. Uh, sorry. Right. We thought you were gone, bro. Uh, I was. But you brought me back. All of you. You fought your way back, my son. You have done well. Thank you, Sensei. The danger is past. Now we must let him rest. Hey, Leo. If you need anything, I'll be right outside. This is your conclusive proof? That is merely a souvenir of your victory. Consider it a gift. This is my conclusive proof. Telltale traces of mutated DNA, Order Colonia, Family Emidide, or in layman's terms, Turtle. Someone's been doing his homework. No doubt one as intelligent as you would recognize that the sheer amount of DNA evidence recovered can only lead to one conclusion. The turtles perished in the blaze. So that's what you look like when you're pleased. I've always wondered. Now, about my reward... I will have a team of foot technicians deliver it to your lab in the morning. Now, if you will excuse me, I have other pressing matters to attend to. Of course, Master. Fool! You let your guard down the moment you believed your enemies vanquished. Soon, the technological secrets locked within this artifact will give me power beyond reckoning. And that's when Baxter Stockman stops taking punishment and starts dishing it out. Hey, <laughs> hey,